Please welcome from Louisiana Lafayette, two-time Pro Bowler and 2013 Walter Payton NFL Man of the That's Year that, recipient, Tina? Charles Tillman. Absolutely. Yes. And from the University of Washington, 1998 third round selection, six-time Pro Bowler and member of the 2000s All-Decade Team, Olin Krutz. CE2, one band, one sound. The New England Patriots have traded the 73rd pick to the Chicago Bears. How's it, Nashville? With the 73rd pick in the 2019 NFL Draft, the Chicago Bears select David Montgomery, running back, Iowa State. Out goes Jordan Howard. In comes David Montgomery. The vision is outstanding. He's so elusive inside the hole. I love his running style. He's my second overall running back. And Joel Platt, this guy carried the Iowa State program the last couple years. There's no doubt. That and, and a pretty good defense that they improved. Matt Campbell, their head coach, did a nice job. But really, it was the engine that was David Montgomery because he does everything. He's got vision in between the tackles, patience. He's got burst. He's a quality leader for Iowa State. Dual threat quarterback out of high school. And real quick, two years ago for Fox Sports, Mark Helfrich worked for us as a college football analyst on games. And I remember having a conversation with him. One of the guys he was most most impressed with that year covering Iowa State was David Montgomery. So that you see how they can carry it and you see the pieces of the puzzle there. Fun. And what David Montgomery does essentially is replace Jordan Howard as the guy who brings a little thump when he runs the football, allows Tariq Cohen to get outside. And Anthony Miller was that kid they moved back into the second round to choose last year. So those are the pieces of the Bears puzzle. With the 126 pick in the 2019 NFL Draft, the Chicago Bears select Riley Ridley, wide receiver, UGA Georgia. Bear down. Go Bears! And so, touchdown! Riley Ridley, wide receiver, 1,026 career receiving yards. Boy, DJ, huh? Add this to the mix there. I think this is a great pick. He is a pure route runner. We talked about Anthony Miller in last year's draft, the best route runner last year. I think they got the best route runner this year as well. Strong hands. The only problem is there's limited production because there were so many mouths to feed in that Georgia offense, not just wide receivers, but running backs. Watch him run routes here. Great space to the sideline. Watch the hands late. Don't throw them up too early. Throws them up late. Beautiful. He can hang in the air along the sideline. Watch him get up and high point this ball, not only to catch it, but watch him twirl around, show you the balance and athleticism, stay in bounds, and get into the end zone. Now he's working against Mika Fitzpatrick. Watch this. Set it up and come back downhill to give the quarterback a nice, safe throw. And he's very efficient at the top. You put him one-on-one -on -one with a safety, forget about it. Two-way go. There is no chance in this situation. Sell it outside, cross his face and you've got a touchdown. I, I think this is a perfect fit in this offense. Tremendous value. They just got a top 50 player, in my opinion. Yeah, second Georgia receiver to come off the board. One more is still left out there. Give Cortez Acton a raise at wide receiver coach there. But how about these pieces of the puzzle? You got your water bug and three Cohen. <laughs> David Montgomery becomes a little more of a hammer, kind of replacing the Jordan Howard position. Allen Robinson is a high flyer, not in, not in terms of speed, but plays over the top and makes a lot of big catches. Riley Ridley will be that technician that you just detailed, DJ. And in Matt Nagy's offense, you need those technicians running routes so that Mitch Trubisky knows they will be there and have the confidence to turn the ball loose and throw it. That graphic didn't even include Anthony Miller, who they are so high on. Yep. I was talking to the Bears guys going into the combine saying team needs all this stuff. They view Anthony Miller as a guy who they got first round production from. So you add all that, you put in Trey Burton. Trey Burton, yeah. <laughs> it's an awesome offense. Sure is. Helfrich at the helm. I, Matt Nagy's got a good thing going right there.
on those downfield throws. Third down, 13. White's busted outside, and White's to the 15, the 10, and the 5, and he's 